Earth. A planet like no other planet we've seen throughout the galaxy. A planet where us Autobots are fortunate enough to take refuge on. And throughout that time of refuge, we have managed to learn and understand human life from our fellow allies. Being so populated with human life, us Autobots will stand in the Decepticons' way in order to keep this planet safe from harm. But little do I think that the true war is just beginning. Right, if I just disconnect this wire here, we connect to this, this one, this should be good to go. <laughs> Bless your spark, B. I would love it if you could help, but your hands ain't exactly the right size for this kind of work. <laughs> Oh, don't worry. As soon as I need your help for something, I'll let you know. I look forward to you helping me be. That's what friends do. I gotta say, I am quite impressed how you handle mechanics and all kinds of other machinery, Cindy. You kind of make me jealous. I try not to make people jealous. All I try to do is fix things that I know I can fix. And hopefully this motorcycle will be running soon. Get this work up and you can soon start repairing us Autobots if we ever get damaged. I came close to doing that once when B got a bad scratch, but that's as far as I've gone to repairing you guys. If you keep this up, she might be able to replace you, Ratchet. Give yourself an old timer a break or retirement. Ugh, oh, please. Cindy doesn't have the Cybertronian mind to repair wounded Autobots. As long as Energon continues to run through me, I don't plan to retire any time soon. Retirement will not come to you yet, old friend. I would still need you on the battlefield if things go south. We will want you to retire yet, Ratchet. Gotta keep the family together after all. Cindy, you better have that motorcycle finished or else you're gonna be late for your first day of college. Please don't make the first day a disappointment. It's almost done. About five minutes. I'm certain I can get it started. Cindy, please do not make a bad impression on your first day for the sake of a bike. <laughs> uh, begging your pardon, Bumblebee. I don't understand what you said, but I'm sure it's something helpful. Bumblebee is volunteering to get Cindy to her college, if it is all right with you. There you go, Cindy. You have a means of transportation. Now go and get your stuff. Okay, I'll get this thing working by the end of the day. I'm sure of it. <laughs> <laughs>